Hi everyone! Hi! Today I'm teaching you how to make this really cool raccoon pencil hugger. So yeah, this is the raccoon pencil hugger and you can see it like closer. I think though I can see. So yeah, it's like this. I'm like moving the camera a little bit. So yeah, this is the, the raccoon pencil hugger. You can see that a little bit closer. Well, super closer and so yeah and yes this is my own original design and let's get started on to the supplies you will need my friends today you're needing a rainbow loom for this project you're also needing a hook just like this one it can be any type of hook it can be a crochet hook metal tip hook a plastic hook any type of hook you just need like a hook oh so yeah have that in mind okay so this are the colors of rubber bands you are needing so you'll be needing white for this project you are also needing this like this sorry my shirt you're also needing black for this project and gray I don't know if you can see that. I'm putting it like under there. You can see the colors over here. So yeah, you'll need these three colors, and let's just get started. Okay, so first, the arrows on your loom should be pointing towards you. So first, grab one gray rubber band and place them from this peg to this peg, just like this. Now. From now on, we're just using two rubber bands unless I tell you we're using one rubber band or more. So, first what we do want to do is stretch these two rubber bands from this peg to this peg. Okay, so you are like, you can, you're following me along. So, yeah. I hope the camera could see what... I'm doing so I can understand force. You can see that. So yeah. And don't worry about the background. Just ignore like the sounds that are on the background. So yeah. Looks on some something like this though. So yeah, your loom should look something like this though. You can see that, hope so. And now we're grabbing the white rubber bands as always using two rubber bands. So yeah. I'm not talking at all. <laughs> so, yeah. Your loom should look something like this, though. And now we're doing the middle. We're placing the middle rubber bands, of course. Your loom should look something like this, though. 
Okay. So now what we want to do is that we want to grab two rubber bands and place them from this pack to this pack. And as always, grab two rubber bands from this pack to this pack. Okay, now we're grabbing some gray rubber bands. So we want to have gray. Hope you could see that on the camera though. Continue this all the way down the loom. Okay, so now we're doing the other side. I'm trying not to fast forward anything so you can get a better understanding on how to make this charm. Well, not charm. What did I just say? Pencil hugger. <laughs> okay. So now, your loom should look something like this. I'm reviewing the loom before we go to the details part. So, yeah. Okay, so now what we just what we have to do is that we have to grab one single gray rubber band and stretch it from this pack, this pack, and this pack. Here, let me just look something like this. Or a triangle, maybe. And now we're putting away our loom and we are grabbing our hook. So yeah, grab your hook. And you have to grab two black rubber bands and you have to create, you have to loop the rubber band three times to create four loops. So one, one, two, three. There are four loops. You could see one, two, three, four. And also the other one, two, three, four. Of course, the raccoon is not having only just one eye. Obviously, he has to have two eyes. Or she. Girl boy. Grab one single white rubber band. I'm grabbing another white one. This one. And I'm passing this through the white rubber band. So, yeah. I always say so, yeah don't know why keep doing this and it should look something like this though grab your loom and you see the triangle we made before uh, so below the triangle we're placing the eye so we are placing the eye on this peg because it's the peg. The peg that it's up is the one who has a triangle, though. Okay. Now separate the eyes. The eyes are not being together, obviously. Okay. And now grab one of the rubber bands in the middle. You see this? Grab one and place it in here. And now, this is how it should look. Okay, so now we're making the nose. Put away our loom again. And grab one single black rubber band and twist it around four times. So one, two, three, four. I'm, I want to do this tutorial fast. 
Okay, so now below the eyes we are placing the nose. So from this peg to this peg. Which will look something like this though. I hope you can see that. And now we are grabbing two rubber bands. So yeah, two white rubber bands and stretch them from this peg to this peg and this peg, forming a triangle. And we're done on the details. Now we need to make the two cat bands in here. We are almost done with the details. We only need to make the ears. The coon has to have ears. So grab your hook. Okay, so grab five rubber bands and we are twisting them on our metal tip hook. So one, we're twisting it four times as we twisted the eyes.